So we've seen Transenteryx, ticker symbol TRXC, go from around 30 cents per share all the way up to $3.70 per share is where it's trading at now. So this stock has more than 10 x just in the last year alone. And what is the upside potential look like? Where are we going to see resistance? And really, what does this company do? Now, this is what we're going to be talking about in this video. So if it sounds like something you're interested in, let's get started. What's up, everybody? I'm Clay. I'm here to make 2021 the best year ever. We're going to grow our portfolios together and we're just going to grow together. Now, if you like the content on this channel, please don't forget to click that like button. And if the subscribe button is still red, do me a favor, click the subscribe button, join the channel and become a bro. And if you're on stock twits, make sure to share this video on there and tag me as well at Claybro so I can follow you there. All right, so let's talk about Transenteryx, ticker symbol TRXC, kind of what they do as a company and where the stock price could go. I know a lot of people have made a lot of money already. We've seen this share price go from 30 cents per share all the way up to around $3.70 per share. So if you're not familiar with Transenteryx, they've got a laparoscopy procedure that they're absolutely revolutionizing. Now, what exactly is laparoscopy? I mean, it's hard enough to just say the word, let alone understand what exactly it is and what exactly this company does. So laparoscopy is a surgical procedure in which they insert uh, a fiber optic tool through the abdomen of a person and they're able to go through this surgery and go through this procedure. It's like robotically. So basically we've got a doctor, we've got him sitting in a chair and he's, he's almost like playing a video game, right? I'm obviously I'm dumbing it down a little bit, but he's got two controls or she's got two controls and they're able to go in and do this surgical procedure robotically. Now, what is Transenteryx doing that's revolutionizing this? They've got a new system, and one of the things that they're doing is they're giving the doctor control through their eyes. Now, what do you mean through their eyes? When a doctor looks at something, the, the machine knows where the doctor's looking, and he's able to kind of understand a little bit better and see what's going on better based on the sensors that are in the machine, and this doctor's able to control what he's looking at without doing anything with his hands. Now, that's one thing that they're revolutionizing. Another one is they have haptic sensors in the tools that they use. So they, they've got haptic feedback. Kind of think about like your phone. When you touch your phone and you've got that little haptic feedback, that's going on in the controls for the doctor. So it's, it's not only better for the doctor, but for the patient as well. And really, they're just innovating so much in this territory, in the laparoscopy space, that they're setting themselves apart from the competition. Now, this is a good thing, right? When the company is setting themselves apart from the competition, we're able to see such growth like we've seen over the last few months. Now, I know a lot of people are wondering, we saw this stock go from 30 cents a share all the way up to around $3.70 per share. So is it time to take our profits? Is it too late to get in if we haven't entered this position yet? And kind of what can we expect in the future from TRXC? So let's talk about it. The stock's trading around $3.70 per share right now. Now, one of the things that I really like about this stock is if we pull it out to a five-year graph, we can see that the next level of resistance isn't really until $7 to $9 per share. So we could see this stock 2x in double in price really before we get to the first level of long-term resistance. So I love to see that. So the next thing I'd like to see on that long-term graph the next level of resistance that we can come into contact with is around $17 per share. Now, this would be a huge more than 5x increase in the share price alone before we get to that second level of res resistance. Now, the next level, and this is what's really got me excited about this stock. On that five-year graph, if we're looking at it at a technical standpoint and a technical analysis standpoint, we won't see another level of resistance until we get to $35 per share. Now, why is this important? A lot of people are so happy with these 10x gains that we've seen over the last year that they think, well, this has got to be the top, right? This, the stock can't go any higher. Well, if we look at these long-term levels of resistance, we could see another 10x increase in the share price before we see this long-term resistance. Now, 
I know so many of us would be extremely happy if TRXC was able to go up another 10x before we saw this resistance. And it's kind of like, no, it's not too late to get into this stock. If they continue to innovate, if they continue to set themselves apart from the competition and really this laparoscopy uh, technology takes hold and it really goes out there, we're going to see the stock price rise as we see this technology used more and more often. Now, uh, don't let me get me, don't let me get ahead of myself here, but if we're talking about resistance, where is one of the last long-term levels of resistance we can see on the long-term five-year graph before we would kind of run into, you know, really looking at old time prices. $75 per share. This would be a 20x increase in the stock price alone before we get to the last long-term level of resistance. Now, I love to see stocks that have potential like this that could shoot up so much further even after they've made such gains like this stock has. You know, 30 cents to share, 30 cents per share, all the way up to $3.70 per share is a huge run, but the potential is there for another 20x increase. Now, do I believe that it could all happen this year in 2021? I think that we would have to see a lot of uh, increase in revenue and this stock really doing a lot more if we were to see the stock price return to $75 per share in this year alone. But I do believe that we could see the testing of $7 per share, $17 per share, and maybe even the $35 per share resistance if we've got a lot of backing, if there's a lot of people interested in this stock and they continue to make waves with this new technology and it really catches on and holds. So I definitely believe that this could be a good long-term investment and no, this, you know, the run isn't over. I don't believe that the run's over for this stock as long as they continue to grow. Now, I always love to know who has what in their portfolios. So if anybody has Transenterics in their portfolios right now, make sure to let us know down in the comments below kind of what price you got in at. If you think that these resistance levels can hold, if you think we might see some pullbacks, or really if you think we can go all the way up and 10x this year to that $35 per share mark. So let us know down in the comments below kind of what your plans are. If you plan on holding it for the long term, if you're a short term trader, you're kind of in, you're out, you're going to take your profit and move on to the next one or what you think. Now guys, if you like the content on this channel, please don't forget to click that like button. If the subscribe button is still red, do me a favor, click the subscribe button, join the channel and become a bro. And if you like the video and you believe in TRXC, make sure to share it on stock twits as well and tag me there at Claybro so I can follow you. Now until the next time, I hope that each and every one of you have an awesome day.